Yo! Today we're taking a look at a game called Sea of Stars. Let's hit the button. Sea of Stars has two main characters. Select the one who will lead the party. We're gonna go with Zale. Look at those graphics. No way, that was awesome. Yeah, what a ride, Elder Mist was wasn't kidding. So the eclipse will happen soon, but we're no closer to the Wraith Island. I doubt we'll find a ship at this altitude. To ground level then? Only one way to go from here anyway. So here's my little party. What does this say? Adventure tips. Traversing the world is a tactile experience. You can hoist up or jump off of most ledges using E. You can also use E to climb, cling to climbable surfaces. More information in the pause menu, blah, blah, blah. All right, let's get into it. Hmm. Might have to change that button. Yeah, I don't like that. We're gonna have to change that. Alright, that's better. Jump over here. Get this chest. 90 gold, not bad. So I saw this somewhere. And I couldn't resist playing it, so here we are. So there's a ledge over here. Is there anything over here? Oh, these are the bad guys, I guess. Alright, let's battle. Got any skills? Solar, let's do that. Sounds good. Hold. I don't know what that is. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Alright, what skills you got? Moonerang, Crescent Art. Let's do that one. One down. Hit us with that thunder, huh? 29 damage. What do you got, kid? Pearl and Nourish. Nice. Combat's a little different, but not bad. What do we have to... Just walk right on it and it hops right on. That's cool. Got some potatoes. I wonder if there's cooking in this game. I have no idea. Alright, what do we got here? Crystal has been booped. And now we got a bridge. Check this way. Oh, this is back where we were. And this way, got some potatoes. Someone was watching us, huh? Hmm. And they make portals.
A few adventures later, our heroes make it to ground level. In the port town of Brisk, a pirate crew promises to get them to Wraith Island in time for the eclipse. On one condition. It's not like you guys have other options. Still, making a deal with a pirate, they seem nice enough to me. All right, here goes nothing. Well, look who it is. A deal. The deal stands if you can't beat Valtrade at arm wrestling. We got an item that needs fetching. After which, Pirate's Honor will take y'all to Wraith Island. What do you say? We got no other choice, so I guess we accept. Everybody, arm wrestling battle! Beautiful. Vault trade, you're up. I'll do it. You guys are strong, it wouldn't be fair. Plus, arm wrestling is a real pirate. How cool is that? Fine, but go easy on the poor fellow. You got it, Valor. I'll be your challenger. Ball trade. Captain. Go all out. We can't leave without it. Aye, aye, Captain. Right, tough one, you look like. Ready? On three. One. Two. Three. What, uh... I did what? I didn't see him arm wrestle. I just see a broken table. What the? What a ripoff! Oof! Cheater! I'm sorry. Did I miss the part where we agreed on no, uh, no magic shirt that rule? Sorry, pal. Captain's orders. Are you kidding? That was awesome. This will be my best anecdote for sure. Show me again. You're lucky we didn't ask about specifics. Should have negotiated when you had the chance. This lesson's on the house. All trade truly is a good at everything. You know it, pal. Now, since you lost the arm wrestling challenge, how about we discuss this little errand? Captain? North of Brisk is the abandoned lab of Arcane Wizard who died a long time ago. It hasn't been open for centuries, but stories say it conceals a coin of undery. Coin of undeath accord. That's a tongue twister. Why do you want it? It's a powerful token. Paying an undead creature would it forces them to do one's bidding. I will use it to... We're not allowed to know, because this is the demo. Huzzah! Fine. How do we get it? Fear is what kept people away all this time, but you look like you can handle yourselves in battle. My crew won't fight. But they'll get uh, get you inside. Nothing. A bit of magic should do the trick. I shall open the way to the abandoned wizard lab. Or my name is not Kenathon. Ahoy, Captain. Ain't you coming with? I will stay here and make preparations for our departure. Fetch the coin of undeath accord, then meet me at the docks. 
Aye, aye, Captain. Oh, I got a big party now. All right, we're out of here. Blow this popsicle stand. Talk to her real quick. If you want to hear a spooky story, just light a campfire and I'll join you. I was on a trip to Lucent once and they also had stools to sit on. I asked for coffee and I explained I had to study for an exam. When well, the waiter said, oh, so not a small than a medium? I said I'm studying for finals. He apologized and gave me a large. All right, well, you're a weirdo. What about this mole? Humble Bo Chef. Nice try with the arm wrestling challenge. Don't sweat it. No one's ever beaten Wild Parade. Well, you could have told me that earlier. So here's the town. Port Town of Brisk. And this is our ship, I guess. Ah, the ocean, bringer of dreams and notion. Maybe it's not their ship. Seems too fancy to be their ship. Did you hear what happened to the Humble Boast? No, is it the pirates again? Seems so. Apparently the table was destroyed again. Those consarn pirates, always up to some mischief. They are indeed. Can I get in there to steal that treasure? Oh, I got treasure right here. Yeah, buddy. Six seafood. One seashell. So it looks like it pays to explore. I want to see them again. Maybe with a better disguise, we wouldn't get kicked out of the humble boast. I saw someone swim under the docks the other day. Such irresponsible behavior. Swim under the docks, you say, huh? Let's see if we got some loot. Just my luck. I got a cart full of goods and only sailors in sight are pirates. Miscreants, I say. I will not be seen aligning with ruffians. Please don't quote me on that. Vacation, best time of the year. Welcome, were you looking for new equipment? Maybe. So we got a rock lid and a power belt, and I've got enough GP for both of them. this this will increase his damage might as well why not all right then we'll go in here uh, resume M Save it. No, oh, not yet. What about you? What do you got? Heading out? Now look at my fresh vegetables. I got enough food, lady. 
What's this? At a save spot? Yep. Sweet. Pirate's Honor. Saved up. I'll just change the hair a bit. My daughter loves boats so much, she talks about them every day. I'm happy I was finally able to take her to Brisk. I just love the salt in the air. That's true, there's nothing like the smell of the ocean. Just breathe in and you'll know how this town got its name. Guess we're heading out. Mitsuda-san's first guest track is here, right here, in the Coral Cascades. This area is out of bounds for the demo, but if you stand here, you can listen to the music. This has been Sea of Stars, an RPG full of adventure, story, and excellent graphics. Check out the game below via the link in the description. All right. Look at that dragon. Would be cool to meet him. He's got a fishing lake here. Oh, we can fish. Cast. Oh, the big cast. Too big. I don't want to cast it that far, dude. How do I... Oh, okay, I gotta hit it again. Oh, okay. Interesting. Got a big one. A lunar trout. Try it again. I lost it. Try it again. Got another lunar trout. Go out a little further, I think. Dang it, he got away. Thanks for watching the video. If you'd like to check out more games, subscribe and check back. I play RPGs, indie games, and oddball games. See you in the next one. Dang it. That, that fish is tough. Let's see if we can get him. Dang, he's tough. Anyway, that's the fishing. No, oh, I meant to frickin' Oh well. I don't know how to get out of here. I 
I don't know what I hit. Anyway, got out of there. We can fish and we can check out this spot. Abandoned Wizard's Lab. I have found the door, but it seems I'll be only be able to, to lift it a few inches. Ball trade. On your mark, pal. Commence. Yolande, hurry. No sweat, big guy. Demolish Demolition is my middle name. Why don't you just put a log underneath it? That's not going to work, is it? Oh, huh, it worked. That's what you get, you old ruin. That's one way to do it. A job well done, mateys. Better let the captain know our part of this mission was a success. I'll remain with Zale's crew for now. These ruins are fascinating to me. Sure can't hurt to have another mage around. Well, I will prove to be a valuable companion, or my name is not Kenathon. Have it your way, then. Coming, well trade. Aye, good luck in there. Into the dangerous place. This is not what I was expecting in here. So there's one lit up. We need to light up the other two. What? What an improbable place. Look at this device. I wonder what it does. This is a lot to take in. Why don't you explore a bit? See what this thing says. Press Y for your mistral bracelet to release bursts of wind. Oh, we can save here, maybe? Setting up a campfire for the first time. So it looks like you can wander around to the campfire. But you can't leave. Want me to read you a story? I only have one so far, but it's kind of spooky. Let's hear it. Of all the recorded hexes and acts of bewitchment, few are as dreadful as the curse of Vesperidine. This story takes us back centuries to a time when a certain band of pirates ruled the seas. Stormcaller was the name of their captain. He was the most powerful wind mage the world had ever known. And their navigator, Hortense, remains to this day the shrewdest mariner on the record. Shrewdest. Combining Hortense's skill and Stormcaller magic, some say their ship was faster than light itself. The crew went on many adventures and accumulated countless riches until one day the inevitable happened. Hortense, whose first love was music, announced that she was ready to quit the pirate life. Ever a firm believer that the real treasure is the treasure of one's finds along the way, Stormcaller took her resignation harshly. Utterly insulted, he stopped con conjuring wind for the snails locked up the ship right in the middle of the ocean we shall remain here till our navigator gets that silly idea out of her head 
But Hortense had already made her final decision. Days went by, both of them sulking while their crew begged for some resolution. First, they ran out of patience, then out of food, and eventually out of drinkable water. The one day after sunset, the pirates, driven mad by hunger and thirst, mutinied and made their captain walk the plank. And as she sank into the abyss, Stormcaller cursed his crew by conjuring an eternal prison. In the sea of nightmare, he would channel a deadly storm for them to endure forevermore. Over centuries, the crew members lost their minds to the ghastly place, until only Hortense remained. To this day, battle goes on in the Sea of Nightmares, storm colors, a hatred pitted against the navigator's sheer will. Some say storm colors' fury will one day sink the ship, while others believe he will inevitably bow to the indomitable Hortense. Legend has it, she gets a short break and once a day for but a few seconds at the precise time the curse was first conjured. Countless sailors and fishermen have since reported sightings of the legendary ghost pirate ship that appears at dusk. They call it the Bespiridine. While some have half a mind to climb aboard in search of treasure, most avoid sailing at dusk for fear of being sucked into the sea of nightmares. The end. Pretty good story there, Pink. Oh, dang it, I didn't mean to hit. Oh, well. Gonna have to skip this. What about you? Got anything to say? The coin of undeath accord. I don't think I'd want to make a deal with that undead. Dead. This place is unreal. I hope Malcolm, Malcolm Mud is doing all right. Oh, okay. You gotta hold it down. Oh, okay. So you got a lunchbox. You only got so much room. Oh, berry jam was a good choice. Alright. Hey, yeah, let's save it in the second one. Off on our way. Who do I talk to? Oh, the fire. Based on old scriptures, you should be able to mix the light from different crystals to open new paths. Quite fascinating. All right. that's our only path right here or is it maybe I need to push this here like a walkway, but I guess not. Hmm. Oh, never mind. I know what to do. There we go. Green crystal. Maybe we put a green crystal in one of these. 